Begin by opening the part you would like to have tapped. Create a circle at the location where you want the threads and dimension it appropriately. When dimensioning holes for tapping, make sure to consult a drill and tap chart. In this example, we want to use a number 6-32 screw, so locate the according nominal hole size on the drill chart and dimension your hole in SOLIDWORKS according to this chart. You can add a countersink if you'd like using the chamfer feature tool, but it is not necessary unless you are using a flathead screw. Click on the drop-down arrow below the hole wizard and select thread. Ignore the size profile warning. Select the hole as the thread location and select the desired tap size. Make sure the thread method is set to cut thread. Apply an offset so that the thread cut begins before the beginning of the hole to create a smooth thread entry for the screw. Congratulations! You now know how to tap holes in SOLIDWORKS. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.